violent criminals off the streets this afternoon. Yeah, all of them were arrested as part of a massive operation by U.S. Marshals, not just here in New York, but all over the country. Abu News reporter Darla Miles is live in Lower Manhattan with the details. Darla. Well, as the most number of arrests uh, that were made in this dragnet were here in New York City, but the target of this task force was very specific and very focused. They wanted the most violent criminals and the most wanted high profile crimes. The Travis Blake case that per had killed three people and, and was the bodies were found decomposing in Queens. Two women and one man brutally murdered days before their bodies were discovered inside of this South Jamaica home. The suspect, 29 year old Travis Blake, was tracked down five days later in a high impact fugitive apprehension initiative. This 30 day initiative, beginning on June 1st and commenced on June 30th, called Operation North Star, resulted in the arrest of violent criminals in New York City. Operation North Star created a strategy to focus on areas that would make the greatest impact on violent crime in these 10 cities, all grappling with the surge in gun violence. Here, the NYPD Warrant Squad and the U.S. Marshal Service concentrating on the Bronx and Manhattan North. This is about targeted, intelligence-driven crime fighting. Of more than 1,500 arrests nationwide, the most were in New York with 339 violent felons taken into custody for the most serious offenses like murder and attempted murder, robbery, aggravated assault, and sexual assault. However, most suspects were already known to the criminal justice system. One third of the arrests made in New York City during this operation were of people who were previously arrested, arraigned, released, and then failed to appear in court. And the partnership with the U.S. Marshals Service came with funding, manpower, and equipment like ballistic shields and entry training. The biggest value of this was is the. Sub between TV, thank you for watching.